What's going on YouTube? My name is Alex. This is Ask the Cheese Gaming. Welcome back to a completely different video I got for you guys today. In this episode, I wanted to go over my Nintendo GameCube collection. Because I realized I have never got through one of my specific collections before. So why not? This is kind of a test. We'll see how this video does. I have no idea if anyone even will watch this or care. I don't even know. But I thought, why not? I got about 15 games for the Nintendo GameCube. So we'll go through this first. Nintendo Indigo GameCube here. I originally had a black one as a kid, but of course with a Wii, like an idiot, I decided to sell it. So I managed to get a pretty good deal. So first we'll go through the controllers real fast. I'll set that off over there to the side. When I got this console, I got this controller to go with it. It's a pretty good deal. Got it for a good price. So a nice little blue controller. Kind of matches the Indigo. See so the front little port, this thing here. Let me grab that. That's actually a wireless receiver. That goes to something I actually just recently found in my toy box. This GigaWare controller. Didn't even, I completely forgot I even had this. Gotta get it cleaned up though, but got a nice little wireless controller. Got the batteries in the back there. So I'm like, hey, cool. This is my oldest started playing some Super Smash Brothers with me. When she started doing that, I ran to the store and got another controller. I got a nice platinum generic one, GameCube controller, because I eventually want to get the platinum system itself as well. I'd like to have this one and the platinum console to match. So a nice little controller there. Let me set that off to the side now. I got two controllers that have survived with me since I was younger, we'll say. <laughs> one is this light up GameStop LED controller, you plug it in, it glows blue, so that's pretty cool. Nice little controller, really enjoy having this one. More used to just kind of sit pretty on the shelf. And then the controller that I use the most, I think I've even featured this in some videos before, my Spice Orange controller here. Fun fact about the Spice Orange, the controller made it to America, but the console itself never did, only the controller. You can see a little lipstick there. Speaking of, if you know how to buff that out with something, comment below. I'd like to get that off the controller, but I don't want to rip off the rest of the paint either, so tell me in the comments below the sacrifices of having kids. Oh well, love them to death. Anyway, let's get into the games. We've got 15 of them. We'll go through these pretty rapid fire. First off, my favorite wrestling game, WWE Day of Reckoning. I like all the customization for this one played this a ton as a teenager. A lot of fun. If you have a Nintendo GameCube, highly recommend this game. If you follow my channel for any length of time, you know that I absolutely love and adore the Extreme G game for the Nintendo 64. Well, there's two games for the GameCube. Extreme G3, which I think is actually better than Extreme G2 on the Nintendo 64. Also complete, but man, oh man, if this game isn't hard. This game just kicks my butt every time I play it. Still, a lot of fun though, so we'll set that right there. The second one, which I only, within the last year, found out that even existed. I didn't even know this game existed. Extreme G Racing Association. I didn't know those four games. So my buddy managed to track this down for me. Also complete, of course. So thank you very much, you know who you are. Let's continue on. Speaking of some racing games, I know, shout out to 123 Gamer Man. He's gonna really enjoy this one game that survived the test of time since I was a kid. Got this brand new way back in the day. Oh, no, you excuse me. I think I got it gently used. Probably from like EB Games. Anybody remember that place? Mario Kart Double Dash with a bonus disc included. Everything's still in there. All complete. And when I bought it, it even came out with a memory card, which I have two memory cards. They're actually plugged into my Wii right now. Got the bonus disc in there as well. Let's continue the trend of Mario. I have one Mario Party game. I don't even remember where I ended up getting this or when I ended up getting it. I don't remember. But I got Mario Party 7 for the Nintendo GameCube. Never really gotten too much into this. I don't know. Maybe one day I just saw it, decided to splurge from a local area game, st game store. Fortunately, no manual, just the game, but hey, why not? Gotta have Mario Party, at least one of them, right? Now, next one, unfortunately, this series never made it to the Nintendo 64, but it made its triumphant return. 
Metroid. Hey, I featured this last year for Halloween. Metroid Prime. Fantastic, fantastic series. Someday I gotta track down the manual for this, but still happy to have it in, in the collection. Amazing, amazing game. Well worth it if you have a GameCube or a way to play it. Highly recommend that one. Let's continue on. One day I was at Goodwill and I managed to see this racing game for a really good price, so I decided why not pick it up. It looked pretty fun. Shrek Smash and Crash Racing. I have featured this on a Time Trial Tuesday episode before. I'm guessing this is just a fake label, but that's okay. I got it for really cheap. It didn't cost, I think, uh, yeah. Considering I think this thing, you know, new goes for like, or uh, online goes for like 30. So I'm happy with it. Fun game. Let's continue right along. My favorite fighting game. I've shown this game a ton. This game needs no introduction. My opinion, the best game on the console for the Nintendo GameCube. Super Smash Bros. Melee. Survived since with me since I was a kid. Played this game a ton. Still play it to this day. Absolutely love and adore this game. Of course, complete. Fantastic, fantastic game. Can't praise this one enough. My opinion for the best Smash game, best fighting game, best game on the Nintendo GameCube console. Have I talked about that one enough? Have I given it enough praise? Let's keep going. Anyway. <laughs> I obviously grew up as a 90s kid, so you probably got to figure another series that I love and adore and have a soft spot in my heart for. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Someday I'd like to own all four of these games for the Nintendo GameCube. I think there's, I think there's four Turtles games. I think the second one's called Battle Nexus. This is the first one. Managed to track it down with the manual. Is it complete? Ah, yes it is actually. So I did manage to buy this complete. Cool. Ah, was it? Surprisingly, this game actually turned out to be a lot of fun. More far better than I expected. I think it's based off the 2012 TV series? Or 20, 2008? Someone correct me down in the comments. I'm not 100% certain about that. But if you know, put it down in the comments. But I'll always have a soft spot into, for the Turtles. The 1990 Turtles movie, the first one, is easily my top five favorite movies ever. Got tons of racing games for the Nintendo 64. Here's another one. Ah, hold on. We'll get to that one in a second. But first, we get another. Yeah. Turtles. This is just mutant melee. This is more of like a fighting beat-em-up. I don't know. It's hard to describe this game, but it's pretty fun. So, managed to track it down. I didn't want to pay a ton for it, so I got just the game. Five bucks. I was like, hey, why not? give it a test. I wasn't really sure about it, so we got that one there. Now, as to the racing game I thought I was about to pick up, because I didn't even look down when I grabbed it. Fortunately, no manual or label on this one, but I'm just happy to have it in the collection, because this game's painful to buy in good condition. Tube Sliders! This game is just trippy. I mean, it's it has a lot of similarities to Extreme G. Check out some gameplay of this game sometime. It's it's something else. I really should feature this one more on a time trial Tuesday. Got to make that happen again. I think I featured it once. A lot of fun, but man, it's trippy. It's it's hard. It's something else. We got four more games to go. Jeez, I got so many racing games for the system. I featured this one before. You already know where it is. Featured its N64 counterpart a ton. Wave Race, Blue Storm. Personally, I prefer the N64 version, but no complaints about this. Got this one, of course, complete. When I realized there was a wave race for the Nintendo GameCube, I had to hunt down myself a complete copy. So, fantastic game. Highly recommend it. And then these last three, I'm just going to clump them all together. I mean, easily best games for the Nintendo GameCube console. The first one up. They're all Zelda games. Have the three of them right there. So let's go through these real quickly. First up, we got Legend of Zelda Master Quest Edition. Of course, complete. Another game that's managed to survive the test of time with me since I was a kid. You can't go wrong with Ocarina. I mean, it's Ocarina. Twilight Princess. Kind of the dark horse of the series, in my opinion. That Majora's Mask. But quite interesting game. I recently picked this one up again not that long ago. I was like, oh man, this game's, this game's something else. 
And then I hear some people love this game. Some people you praise and adore it. I don't know. I need to go back to it. It's just its cartoony graphics are so different. If you've played Wind Waker, put down in the comments with below what your opinion of it is if you made it this far into the video. I don't know. I really need to sit down and play it again. But lately I've been so busy with Majora's Mask, I want to beat that one first. But that's my 15 games, everybody. If you're interested in seeing more videos like this where I go through one of my collections, comment below. Again, Nintendo Game Keeps one of my smaller collections. Just because unfortunately the price of so many of these games has just shot up astronomically. Hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. Until next time, everybody.